Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you how to extract subtitles from video files using file flows. So to begin, come to the flows page, click add. Uh, we're going to be basing this on a blank video template because the uh, um, video flow. I'll just call it sub extractor. Add. We start with a video file, that's what we want. Um, and we've come down to the video nodes, there's a subtitle extractor. We drag that into the flow. We call this um, extract um, is SRT. Uh, we're English as a language. Um, you can get the language codes from this page here. Um, and output file. So output file, if you leave it blank, it will just create by default an SRT um, file in, in the same directory as the original video file. Um, so that's what we want this time. You know, we just want to use SRT. So click save. We connect OS2 up. And say um, we want to also uh, extract um, ASS, so we'll come to Subtitle Extractor, uh, Extract ASS, which is an acronym. Uh, so here, um, if we leave a blank, it will be the same as the video, um, as the SRT. So um, we've got this example here saying folder the origin slash full name slash File the origin slash file name dot srt. So that's saying the original um, folder name slash the original file name dot srt. So we'll just copy this here, and we'll change srt to ass, and I click save. And uh, this has two output nodes saying uh, the first output node saying it was extracted, so it did find some um, subtitles to extract. This means the second one means there was no subtitles that can extract. So for this one, we just want to connect the first one um, output from this one to the input of this one. So there is something to extract, and it would just extract it twice. And um, this node is kind of special as it doesn't update the working file. Um, so usually they do update the working file, so the file will change. But since this one's just extracting subtitles. It, it doesn't change a working file, so we still have the same working file coming into this node as we had it into this node, which is just a video file. So, you know, D drive slash movie slash my movie dot mkv is the input file here, and it's the same input file here. And you click save, and that's, you're done. Um, you can just go add it to a library. Um, it's a video library. Uh, Subtitle extract is what I called it. Names already in use, so let's call it something else too. And yes, and now it will just uh, go through my directory and find any video files and extract those two subtitles for me. Um, that's it, nice and simple today. Um, take care, let us.